okay guys uh, i'm starting on the uh, video on how to tune your carburetor this is my uh, uc 500 enfield uh, and this is the carburetor for uc 500 what you would need is one normal screwdriver uh, like this and a tachometer also called RPM meter tachometer or uh, uh, is uh, optional I'll also teach uh, how to tune it without uh, the tachometer uh, though it won't be as accurate as tuning with tachometer so it will be preferable okay so uh, now uh, we will get the details of the uh, um, uh, carburetor right so that uh, uh, it is helpful when I'm referencing them when you are looking at a carburetor you just divide it into uh, two parts one towards uh, uh, towards the engine and other uh, towards the air filter side so when you draw an imaginary line here if uh, the screw which is this one is placed near the engine like in our model then it is called a fuel screw if it is placed uh, near uh, the car um, um, air filter uh, which is on this this side then it becomes an air screw currently we are calling this screw a fuel mix mixture screw only so this is the uh, fuel mixture screw this is the idling screw first thing you want to do is mark the their current position so count the threads for the idling screw for me it is one two three four five then uh, you will want to mark the uh, current position of mixture screw so just create a scratch or bottom and start turning them then uh, till it won't turn anymore ensure that you don't screw on too tight or the needle might break so i'm turning it clockwise one two three so it's currently at three and a half I'll turn it back to its original position one two three three and a half so before the tuning process you have to remember that uh, bullet engine has to be warmed up uh, completely so you can go for a ride for five six kilometer try to uh, drive it in speed so that uh, the engine warms up properly and then start the tuning uh, the first step for tuning your carburetor would be increase the rpm to uh, to double its current idling rpm usually the R, uh, rpm for a bullet is set at 800 to 1200 rpm uh, depending on the climate say it is winter then you can set it at 1200 rpm in summer it, it can also work at 900 or uh, 1000 rpms so now you have to double it what I, uh, I will do is I'll start my bullet and I will start increasing the uh, idle screw
सो नाउ आई हैव डबल द आर पी एम एंड यू कैन हियर द इंजन साउंड नाउ वॉट यू हैव टू डू इज मेक मेक द इंजन एज लीन एज पॉसिबल फॉर दैट यू विल हैव टू अगेन मूव द मूव द मिक्सचर स्क्रू इन क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन सो इफ यू सी एंड मूव इट इन हाफ ट्राई एंड नॉट मेक टाइटन द स्क्रू अदरवाइज द स्क्रू माइट ब्रेक टाइटन इट विथ वेरी वेरी लाइट हैंड सो आई एम मूविंग इट इन हाफ सो दिस बिकम्स वन टू so th- this is the lightest that this engine can run on now what you have to do is uh, if you move any any further the engine will shut down so from here you have to start screwing uh, counter clockwise till your rpm doesn't increase or uh, uh, as you start screwing it counter clockwise you will hear increase in sound when the sound becomes exactly at the point when the sound becomes constant you have to stop people who are who have got their tachometer can look at the needle going up in tachometer as soon as the needle stops moving upward they will have to stop uh, tuning so now i am starting to screw you see it is rising so this is one turn it is rising two turn it is still rising three turn it is still rising Three and a half. Af- uh, so you see that after three and a half turn, there is no change in sound. So when there is no change in sound, it means that that is the point that you should stop turning. So once uh, you have uh, reached the optimum uh, level, uh, next uh, you will have to bring uh, the idle. a mixture screw that is this to its original position for as we uh, we had recorded earlier for me it was at 5 threads so i'll bring it to my oh. 5 thread position so now uh, you can take your Uh, bullet for a ride if you hear knocking sound might be you will need to make the uh, carburetor rich by turning it uh, counter clockwise uh, half uh, half is a turn or quarter a turn if there is no knocking sound it is running perfectly well it is feeling lighter then that is your best tuned uh, uh, carburetor that uh, you can have so you can uh, go ahead and take it for a spin thank you